Welcome back to our kitchen. Iron Chef of Sheba's Kitchen is chopping away at four quails. Today we are going to make quail korma. K -k -k quail korma. Now the Iron Chef is skinning the quail. He got all the skin off. He just has, we have clean meat. That's what we are going to use. So Iron Chef is washing. He cleaned. <laughs> As you can see, he is chopping them real thin. Now Iron Chef is using a paper towel to draw out the excess moisture from the onions. So they'll fry up really crispy. The chef is picking up all the onions and they go in hot oil. Looking at the onions and he's making sure that they all are golden brown not dark brown and that is it's almost there and I think he's going to leave some of the onions in the pot but the rest of the onions he's going to take them out chef is putting the onions in brown paper bag to make them more crispy and the oil will be drained out five six black peppercorns and the oil to perfume the oil. Next, cloves will go in. This will all perfume the oil. Then goes green cardamom. Now I think he is reaching out for the quails, the drained quails, and he is going to fry them with the oil in the oil. Ooh. Put ginger and garlic, and he's going to put them in a teaspoon of minced ginger and minced garlic. I'm sure you can hear oil burst. In a bowl, he is taking out. The chef is taking out ground coriander chili pepper i think he has mixed the spice blend and he's putting them in This is the salt, kosher salt. He has put a handful, that's a teaspoon. Now I think he's going to taste the masala. Just to check the seasoning, going for more spices. I think he's putting in chili pepper. It must be bland. There you go. I think he likes spicy. I think Chef has added a little bit more water. To cook the spices yet again. Iron Chef has put in some little bit of more water and he's closing the lid and it's gonna cook on low heat. In the meantime he's going to do something different. He has taken out cardamoms, the black cardamoms, and he's going to smash them. There you go. To take the seeds out. He's pulling the seeds out and I think he's going to grind them. He's taking, he took out one more cardamom. Smash, smash. He has to open the lid first, which he forgot. The chef is making such a big mess out of my kitchen. Oh great, now to clean it up. 
he got the yogurt out and I think he's gonna make yogurt smoothie out of the fried onions and yogurt hairy arm is draining excess oil and I think the chef hairy chef will put the onions in the blender I think he took three tablespoons of yogurt is putting in the smoothie yogurt smoothie and this will give the gravy its thickness he's tasting for the seasoning I think he needs maybe salt uh, kosher salt that will bring out flavors the chef is still not happy he took the blender and it had remaining smoothie he put a little bit of water in it and I think he's going to cook the quail further I think it will be on low heat for about 10 minutes and then the quail will be done ready to eat yum yum he is adding a little bit of more about two three teaspoon of crushed onions to make the gravy grainy this step you do it at the end when everything is cooked this is the consistency he wants and now he is going the last step he's going to hit it with the cardamom powder Mmm, it smells delicious in here. This is the last step and the quail korma is done. Thank you for watching my video. And for all the recipes, go to shebasrecipes.com. But you know what? I don't know whether the chef will share it with you or not. Take care. Bye.